Well, how do the chums design Captain of the Steves? And today, chums, I'm hitting up the subside demo. Now, this is pretty darn freaking cool as far as demos go. And it's a bit of a workout as well. It's actually really good fun. I'm going to start a new profile. I've already played this game to death. I already know where I'm going. Inside of this video, what I plan to do is show you where all the stuff is to unlock everything. So, yeah, this is actually made just by one person. Freaking awesome stuff. Right, all the settings, everything that I have is all set up how I like it. So I can just create a new profile. Yes. And yeah, I just want to move the floor down a tad. Just so it's um, in line with my own floor. So about, say there. Next, I have to set my height. Done. And I want to be able to just swim, please. Because I want a bit of a workout. And here we go. So we're now in the simulation room. Welcome. Step on the platform to begin. Reminds me a bit of an Assassin's Creed. <laughs> there we go. Boom. Those signs will still st say in the st simulation. So does all this. It's like a hollow deck from freaking Star Trek. Look at that. Bloody awesome. Okay. Right. And the way that you swim is just how you'd swim in life. You can go back again now you can actually just physically turn in your chair or you can use the hat stand the thumb stick to just turn on the spot it's pretty awesome and you have to go up for air and look at that transition look at all the water running down my visor freaking cool okay i i, I understand how to swim i can swim look i can swim yeah you can get rid of that you can get rid of that annoying message now thank you well, there's a car park just sitting there huh. There's a treasure chest just here, okay? So if I go over here, see this little lock box here? You're probably wondering, well, how the heck do you open that? Because you need a key. Yeah, if you go to the front of it, it does show you need a key. Now I'll just turn around so you can see that you need a key there. Okay, right. Um, I will show you where the key is. If you head on over to that rock over there, So here we go, swim up a bit, heading over to this rock. One, there's a pretty cool rubber ducky on this. Pow! And look, it, it even makes quacking noises. <laughs> when you let go of it, it bobs. It's actually got real physics and everything. It's so cool. Okay, anyway. Swimming over this way. Boom, boom. And I'm heading over towards that sign over here. So there's a pipe just here that you can swim through. There's a coin inside of that pipe. So let's, let's go get the coin inside of the pipe. There's quite a lot of coins to collect. So here we go. I'm going to go through here. Boom. And on the opposite side of this pipe, there's your first floppy disk as well. I'm going to grab that. Right, I better swim up and get some air. Lovely jubbly. Oh yeah, I can turn using this hat stick. That's probably quicker than turning in the water. There's like a, a little jar thing there as well. Some sort of like little dead weight. All of it's got all the real physics and everything. It's so cool. Wait, there you go. It just drops like lead. Boom. Cool. Loads of coins to be found, just dotted about the place as well. If you get 15 coins, you can buy a watch that actually gives you your oxygen reading, which will be great for the next level. Uh, there's another coin there, down by this shell. Boom. Coolio. Let's move this way a little. There's also a plastic shark that we've got to find as well. And the shark will open up the shark level, but we can't do it in the demo. Right. Down here, there's a coin, I think, as well. No, not, not under that rock. There's one that looks very similar to this. Anyway, we're back at the old lockbox, and I didn't pick up the key, did I? Okay. Well, it's, it's over there anyway. It's over by that pipe. We'll go back over there. Uh, there's a shark! There's only one shark in this area. Hello, buddy. Yeah, the um, the actual key is somewhere around here. 
Whoops. That's where we got the disc. Well, I was pretty sure that the key was around here anyway. I mean, I could be mistaken. There it is. There's the key. Just got to check that I'm centred. There we are. Right, we'll go back to the lock box, which is over past the rock with the duck. You can swim quite fast in this game. Oh, there's two key there's two coins here as well. Let's swim down. So the first one is just here. Boom. And the other one is at the opposite side of these. These rings. Oops. Well, I balls that up. Doesn't matter though. There right, we go. Give me that. Sweet. Better go up and get some oxygen. Now, near some of these jellyfish is a, another one of the floppy disks, but I don't think it's this this pack of jellyfish. I think there's another pack of jellyfish somewhere else. We've got a bit of a rock over here, which I think this is the rock that I was thinking of earlier that's got a coin under it. Oh, it's at the opposite side. So I'll go up and over. There's another coin here. Oh, 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 oh. Can I get you? Yes, I can. You can even pick up the starfish. Ha ha ha! Starfish! Yeah, right. It's landed down by the coin. Go get the coin. There's another coin here in front of the car. This one's really tricky to get. Oh, I got it first time. That took me ages to get that first time around when I first spotted that. There's another coin here. And you may have noticed that there's another floppy disk inside of this car. Now this is right under the rubber ring. Okay, so let's just go in here. Get that. Now you can grab hold of stuff. To hold yourself underwater that little bit better. And then right reach. Uh, got to hold onto that. Pull myself towards the chair. Uh, I'm getting pulled out by the current. I'm going to run out of oxygen anyway. So I better go back up. Get my oxygen. There's another coin on top of the car. I'm going to pull myself down into the car. Come on. Get that. Let's get out of the car. Oh, ow. Touch the wall. <laughs> I'm really in a little room. Come on. Let me out. I don't want to run out of oxygen. Back up. I want to show you the physics of this rubber ring. Watch this. Boom. If you pull it down, swim all the way down, just using one hand. Actually, I can just let go of it, look. Bam. Blop. Haha. <laughs> it's cool. Yeah, here's some other jellyfish here. And I think the other disc is just past these guys. Oh no, we're going back. This is the same packet of jellyfish earlier, isn't it? Oh yeah, I got thrown around on myself. Okay, well we can go back to that other lock. We can go back to the lock box, I suppose. Oops, sorry, I think I just punched the microphone then. Where am I? Yeah. Probably best I turn using this. I keep forgetting that I can just turn using that. Oh, there's another coin there. Now you can just pull yourself along things to move a little bit quicker while in the water. There you go. Boom, 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 boom. Aha, there's another one of the floppy disks over here. Just grab that, and that's by the jellyfish over here. If you want to know where I am in the in the realm of water, it's all about this side wall, just past that little sign over there. Okay, right, and I'm going to head back to that rock where the the duck is, and if I'm heading over that way. Hopefully, oh, where's it gone? There it is. Hopefully, I'm going to come across that lock box because it's on its. It's kind of in line with that. That's kind of where we started, you know. Ah, get off! 
Yeah, put it. There's the shark. Hello there, bud. He's lovely, isn't he? Lovely. Give him a stroke. Okay, so this is kind of near to the start. I think the lockbox is somewhere around here, isn't it? There's the end of the stick. There's the weight that I picked up and played with earlier. Ah, the lockbox is... Oh, yeah, it's right this way. Yep. It's very easy to get lost. There it is. I swam straight past it, didn't I? Okay, here we go. Let's put the key in. And um, we can open this box. Come on. Open. Dang it. Let's swim up and get some air. Get back down. Let's try and open it from here. There you are. You get back. This is really nitty to open this one. Ah! Come on, that's it. Done! We've unlocked the watch. As long as we get the 15 coins, we're good. Right, so I still need to get just one more of those discs. And it's it's pretty much on the edge, I think, of um, the actual map. And it's fairly near to the plastic shark that I mentioned earlier. Now, the plastic shark is kind of tucked behind a rock. It's not this rock. It's a rock over this way. Well, I say it's a rock. It's more of a... I think it's like a tree stump? Or a tree... Yeah, a tree stump. Keep going. On the way there, I'm just going to keep an eye out for coins. But you just swim around the outer perimeter and you come across it. Hello, fishy. No coins there. Here it is. This is where you find the shark. Here he is. Okay. That's him. Got the shark. Done. Okay, right. There's a couple of coins down by this bottle. There's one here. Can I just reach that? Yeah, got it. And there's, oh, I think, one on top of this rock. If I haven't already got it, I think I might have got it earlier. Because I came over this way. But we've just got one more disc to get. Sadly, I, I can't remember where the other disc is. Not this far out. I think it's back over this way. And uh, over here. Let's just go around the outer perimeter. Pretty much all the discs are on the outer perimeter. They're not really too difficult to find the discs. It's the 15 coins that's the really tricky one. I mean, I have found far more than 15. I think of my total that I've got on another save is something like 18 coins that I've managed to find. So I think there might be 20 total in this one area. There's another one there. And there's the last disc over there. Okay, any other coins here while I'm here? No. Okay, let's swim down there. Let's get the other disc. Ouch. We've got the disc. That's all discs done. We've got the... New area unlocked. New area unlocked. We've got that message. Let me just have a look, see if we can find any more coins here. Yep, I'm not ready to go out to the main screen yet. I just want to have a look. See if there's any other coins. Not seeing any coins there. There is a football down here, which is really fun to play with. Let me just show you the football. Turn around. Grab said football. Boom! <laughs> How cool is that? Okay, right. Let's have a look, see if we can find any more coins. Any more, any more coins. I think I might have got quite a fair few coins. The only thing is, there's no real way to see how many coins you've actually got until you go to the menu area. I think I might have enough for the watch. That's the only thing that I want to unlock anyway on this save. 
and I'm hoping when the full game comes out, I'm hoping we can continue on with our profile. If that is the case, hopefully I've given you guys enough out there to complete the demo. Alright, anyway, let's see if that's the case then. Okay, so here we go. Let's see if we can do it. Sweet! So, I, un I unlocked this one by getting all four of the floppy disks. I unlocked this one by getting the plastic shark. It looks like we'll probably end up getting another three plastic sharks in here to then go on to this one, is what I'm thinking. Let's go into the shopping basket. I've only got 12, so I need to go back in and find the remainder for the coin for the, the watch. But it is a case of just swimming around and you are going to come across them. But I would say save up for that. I've found 18 coins so far. That's my highest amount. So I've got a bit more swimming to do. But I think I can do that in my own time. And for now, people, that is subside. And it's done by one developer. It's amazing. It's awesome. You have to play it. You really do. It's so cool. So chums, that's subside. Freaking awesome. I really, really enjoyed that. It's very immersive. Yeah, submersive, immersive. Very cool. Just by, by one developer. I put all the links in the video description for what you need. If you've found something that I haven't found, if you've played this and you've found another shark or something, let me know in the comments roughly where you found it and I'll go looking for it. But thank you very much for watching, people. Hopefully you find enough coins to get your watch. It's not that hard to do. It just takes a bit of time. And it's a case of just scouring around to try and find it. Anyway, hope you enjoyed this. Goodbye, goodbye, and goodbye again. Deep down.